What's up guys? Welcome back to Personalized Strength. Today we're going to go over why carbs are essential for building muscle. It'd be awesome if you guys could give the video one of these and click the subscribe button. Now let's get started. So what are carbs? Carbs are the main macronutrient and the body's main source of energy. Carbs are broken down into glucose that can be used as energy to fuel your workouts. The three main types of carbs are sugar, starches, and fiber. Sugar is sweet and the main types of sugar found in carbs are glucose, fructose, galactose, and sucrose. Starches are a complex carb that can be found in most diets. Examples of starches in food are potatoes, rice, pasta, and bread. Fiber keeps hunger and blood sugar under control and it monitors the body's use of sugars. So what is the difference between simple and complex carbs? Well, simple carbs are digested quicker and provide a short period of energy. Simple carbs, also known as simple sugars, can be found in fruits, vegetables, and nuts. The simple sugars that you want to limit or avoid are packaged cookies, pastries, cereal, and sodas. Complex carbs, on the other hand, are more nutritious, contain more fiber, and are slowly digested, which gives you a longer period of energy. They are also more filling, which prevents overeating. Complex carbs can help protect you against type 2 diabetes and other forms of cancer. Examples of complex carbs are bread, rice, corn, oats, and peas. The amount of carbs that you eat in your diet should be about 55 to 65 percent of your daily caloric intake. Some examples of good carbs that you can have in your diet are oatmeal, potatoes, brown or white rice, pasta, bananas, and quinoa. There are some myths out there regarding carbs on whether or not you should include it in your diet when trying to build muscle. If you're trying to build muscle, you want to eat the right foods or you could be defeating the opportunity of what you're trying to do. Here are some myths about carbs and reasons why they should be a staple in your diet. Number one, carbs make you gain weight. This is true if you eat too many simple carbs, such as white bread, pastries, and desserts. They're not filling and they can lead you to feeling hungry after you've eaten. This can cause you to overeat, which can lead to you having type two diabetes over time. On the other hand, complex carbs such as potatoes, wheat bread, brown rice, and oatmeal, they can make you feel full, which can prevent you from overeating. Number two, carbs should not be eaten at night. No matter what, carbs should be eaten in moderation but time does not affect how our body processes carbs. There are actually some benefits to eating carbs at night, such as improved sleep and increasing the production of serotonin in the brain. Serotonin is a transmitter that helps reduce depression and regulates anxiety, which can help you sleep better. You also won't wake up in the middle of the night feeling hungry. Number three, all white food is bad. White food that has been processed and refined, such as white bread, pastries, white flour, and crackers should either be eaten in moderation or avoided. Natural white foods such as nuts, seeds, potatoes, cauliflower, onions, garlic, they are actually good for you. Number four, protein is more important than carbs. Without a doubt, protein is essential for building muscle mass. However, carbs are equally as important. You actually need to consume the right amount of protein and carbs so your body doesn't convert the protein into energy. Protein and carbs are necessary for building muscle pre-workout and for optimal recovery post-workout. If you're looking to build muscle, here's why you should eat carbs. Number one, glycogen is stored for energy. Glycogen occurs when your body breaks down carbs and converts it into glucose. The glucose is then stored in your liver and muscle cells and serves as a form of energy to fuel your muscles during your workout. The right amount of carbs need to be consumed post-workout in order to replenish your glycogen levels. Number two, provide sustainable energy. Carbs are the main source of the body's energy. Complex carbs are solely digested and provide a long-term source of energy after they've been broken down. Simple carbs are digested quicker and provide a short-term boost of energy. Number three, improves your performance in the gym. Increasing the glycogen stored in your liver and muscle cells will provide a sustained period of energy during your workout. This will improve your performance by pushing you to train harder 
without feeling any fatigue. It's beneficial to eat a high carb diet to ensure that you're performing at your best. Number four, carbs repair muscles post-workout. During your workout, your muscles are using the glycogen stored for fuel. Afterwards, your body is low on glycogen, requiring more to repair the muscles that have been damaged. When you eat the right amount of carbs after your workout, your body will restore the glycogen repairing and rebuilding the muscles. It'll give your body an increase in insulin, which will add more nutrients to your muscles to help them grow and recover faster. Number five, fiber maintains good health. Carbs contain fiber to help build and maintain muscle. Fiber normalizes your bowel movements and keeps your food moving through the digestive system. It also helps to control your insulin levels by slowing down sugar and carb consumption in the bloodstream. If you don't consume enough fiber, it'll increase your insulin levels and any excess glucose will be stored as fat. Eating fiber increases insulin sensitivity and your immune system as well as controls blood glucose. A stronger immune system helps you to recover faster. Recommended women consume at least 25 grams of fiber and men 38 grams of fiber per day. Number six, prevents muscle loss. You need to eat enough carbs, otherwise you could lose muscle. Reducing the number of carbs you eat, the glucose will then begin to break down the protein in your body to be used as a source of fuel. As a result, the hard work that you've been putting into the gym to help build muscle mass will start to become undone. Also, reducing the number of carbs in your diet will increase the number of nitrogen being eliminated from your body. Nitrogen is a compound found in amino acids that helps build muscle. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. It'd be awesome if you guys give the video one of these, click that subscribe button, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.